doing a reading for a friend and my cards want me to talk to them about me because I need a message and I'm a little nervous so I'm going to do this with you guys. I've been getting the sign that I need to practice and hone in my psychic gifts because something big is coming. I have been really, really, really wanting to do some live readings and I've not let myself and I don't know why. So I decided uh, my human got into it. I don't know which one it was. I decided that I'm going to offer five readings at a discount for half off, uh, $34 for 30 minutes. And it's going to be able to be booked on amandasapothecary.com. And you can also book me on Amanda's Apothecary 712 on Etsy. But enough about that. I pulled my cards. Let's see what they have. I ask for guidance on my psychic gifts and where I need to go from here because I really want to open up more. Life purpose. The purpose of your life is to serve in a way that brings joy. Oh, to serve in a way that brings great joy to yourself and others. Don't worry about finding your purpose. Instead, focus upon serving a purpose and then your purpose will serve you. I'm here to serve. I'm here to help you guys heal. And I know I am. So I'm so excited to get into this. Oh, no, it's at 111. I'm going to read the book, too, since we got a little time. It's so important, if you're a reader, to do this for yourself. I feel like I'm the hardest to read. Because we block ourselves. Uh, oh, no, life purpose. That's not a book. The perp oh, this card comes as a reminder that you need... You needn't struggle to find your life purpose. Don't worry about how to make good money in a meaningful career. Don't concern yourself with quitting or starting jobs or professions. Instead, follow the path of your natural desires, talents, and passions. With the full intention of bringing joy to yourself and others, your life purpose doesn't need to be defined or pinpointed. It's a process, not a category. Oh, that's beautiful. So I'm going to keep staying in my own lane, doing the things that I want to do, listening to those divine whispers from God. Looking at the signs all around me, leaning into my guides, asking for help, asking my loved ones that have passed for guidance. I'm telling you, my life is so much better. Additional meanings for this card. Give all worries of my, about money or career to God and the angels. You're on the right path towards your life's purpose. That could make me cry right now. Focus on one step at a time with respect to your life's purpose and release fears about the future to the angels. What you're doing right now is part of your life's purpose. Literally, this is part of my life's purpose. I'm meant to help people heal. I am a psychic. I am a nurse. And I love psychology. So that combo is very potent and very powerful. I have a very strong intuition. I've connected to my heart chakra. Like, I'm on fire, guys. I've got another one that I'm going to read because there's even more. Time to let go. The sun sets and rises each day, and it's the same with the avenues in your life. See the beauty within each sunset in your life, and know that the sun will always rise again tomorrow. Endings are merely the start of a new beginning, and we are with you through each phase and cycle. So yeah, new beginnings, life purpose, this is all connecting for me. <sighs> time to go. It's time. It is time. Mm. The angels bring you this card to help you admit to yourself that it's time to leave. You already know the situation they're referring to. Okay. It's telling me to slow down my nursing role and jump into my psychic role. You've hesitated leaving because of loyalties and fears, yet the angels assure you that it's the best way. Work very closely with your angels during this transition to ensure it's harmony for everyone concerned. Surrender any guilt or other negative emotions to heaven as your energy needs to stay high right now. Talk about taking my breath away. Additional meanings for this card. Completion and the end of a cycle are at hand. The purpose has been served in this relationship or situation. Surrender and release. Call upon Archangel Azrael for help with grieving and Archangel Michael for help with courage. Oh, I love this. Where is this? I like learning from the angels. They're so beautiful. Thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you, universe. Thank you, angels. Thank you, thank you, thank you, spirit guides. Thank you to my loved ones. 
I'm placing protection over myself. I'm placing protection over my family. Anything that is here with negative energy needs to get out right now. You are not welcome. Only love and light in this home. And I'm sending good vibes to you, friends. Thank you for watching.